All that smoke rising from the industrial fire continues to raise concerns, though, in the community about how safe the air is outside and if it can affect your home. Action 7 News reporter Alyssa Munoz has the answers to your questions. Well, Sasha and Doug, we've received multiple calls of concern over this incident from people who own swamp coolers and those with health issues. For people who own swamp coolers, experts say the air in those homes should be fine because of the media pad that is in the cooler that helps turn warm air into cool air. I think as long as the media pads on the evaporative coolers are staying wet, there's a highly unlikely opportunity for the particles to get into the home. James Johnson is a manager at Thompson Heating and Air Conditioning here in Albuquerque. I think it's pretty safe to say that, you know, unless your your house got engulfed in smoke, that it's it's a safe bet that there are no cause for harm or concern. Unless your house was really close within a couple miles or you are currently smelling something different today than you were a couple of days ago, you should definitely have your system looked at. This morning, the city of Albuquerque Environmental Health confirmed the fire is out and it is safe to be outside now. And now that the fire has been put out, the cleaning process of any of those toxins will fall back on the business owner and they can work with the state or other agencies on this. Reporting in Albuquerque, Alyssa Munoz, KOAT Action 7 News. We also spoke with the Albuquerque Bernalillo County Water Authority and they say there are no concerns about groundwater. Now we contacted United Poly Systems for comment, but they did not reply.